All right, what is going on, guys? I'm your host here on Speakable Gaming, and today we are in the train station because today we are going to be taking a look at the train mod for Minecraft 1.6.2, also known as the Rails of War mod. So let's go ahead and enter the south entrance right over here. As you can see, this is going to be the south entrance, or actually. Yes, no, north entrance, same thing, whatever, south or north, it really both goes down to the train station. Um, anyways, let's go ahead, and as you can see here, we have a beautiful locomotive along with a beautiful looking track compared to the normal Minecraft track over here. It just looks disgusting compared to this. So as you can see, this is going to be the Rails of War mod, but I like to call it the train mod, as simple as that. So first off, as you can see, you're going to have this beautiful train track, and let me go ahead and tell you a little bit about this mod before we jump straight into it. So first off, this mod is currently still in development if you ask me because they're adding a lot of new tracks um, and a lot of new stuff into it so let's go ahead and jump in and show you everything that has in store for us as of right now so if we go into your creative menu just like that if we go over a page and go under the rails of war tab this is everything that you are going to have as of right now so first off looking at the very first thing we're going to have this pointer and apparently you're supposed to start the train on this thing because it's just I guess it's just the safest to start it on this I don't really know but it honestly it doesn't really matter where you start the train so this is kind of I guess you could say useless and then we're going to have the rails which are going to be the straight rails and then the right turn left turn dead end you have the right switch the left switch and you have the crossing and you have the locomotive now right now I can show you these two things and I can show you the crossing this is going to be your crossing right here as you can see so you're gonna have four different ways a train can go you can go four different ways or coming in at four different ways so you can go this way this way this way blah 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 you get the point and then we are going to have a dead end right here so this is going to be at the end of a track obviously um, the train will come up to a stop and why is the train floating why is the train floating okay that's really weird anyways as you can see this is going to be a dead end but and then the other things I will show you um, the right turn the left turn and the right switch and the left switch I will show you all those after I show you how to work and operate the train because we have to go above and because we need a lot more room to show you these things because they're kind of big the right turn and the left turn so let's go ahead and take out the locomotive and let's go ahead and set it on the track just like that as you can see and to start up the locomotive you are going to need some coal so let's go ahead and just search for some coal I'm just gonna go ahead and grab a stack but it really doesn't matter since we are in creative and by the way there are no crafting recipes I believe I already said that but anyways let's go ahead and if we right click on it as you can see we just right clicked one piece of coal on the train as you can see we already got the steam engine running it is pumping and it is ready to go but just to be safe we're gonna click it a few times just to put as much coal in there as possible and then then to get on it you're going to simply right click just like you get on a horse and you're going to press left shift to dismount just like a horse or a pig and then to go forward you are going to press R to go forward um, that is going to be the main controls then we don't want to crash so we might want to hit V for the brakes and then if we want to back it up and go the other way we might want to press F so those are going to be your main controls for this steam engine powered train machine so like I said R is going to be forward and actually we're gonna to have to press V first for the brakes and then R is going to be forward I'm pressing R right now let's press the brakes again so we can stop and let's go ahead and press F so we can go backwards so R F V are going to be your controls and we're gonna go ahead and press left shift to dismount Ooh, we're getting a little glitchy uh, sorry about that but that is going to be about it for um, the train let's go ahead and show you all these other parts all right guys so we are back here to show you the rest of the parts uh, here is going to be the right turn as you can see if we just click it down just like that you're going to get this huge right turn and then if we go over to the left turn it's obviously going to be the same thing turning left instead of right and then if we just turn around and we are going to show you the right switch here is the right switch obviously as you can see you can go two ways you can either go right 
or you can go straight so that is pretty cool and then here we have the left switch which is obviously going to be the same thing but in the opposite direction and now let's go ahead and while we're out here let's go ahead and show you some of the other things like the dead end and the stuff like that so here is going to be the crossing right here and as you can see you can just build right off of it just like that if we wanted to build off of it and make it go different directions that is going to be the crossing and then the dead end let's go ahead and show you that by clicking it down we're going to show you what it looks like on a track there is the dead end so that is pretty cool as you can see so let's go ahead and see what else we have Alright guys, so that is actually going to be about it for the train mod, aka the Rails of War mod for Minecraft 1.6.2. Um, like I said, they are adding a lot more stuff. They are adding a lot new types of train pieces, ones that are cur ones that can go up and down. So if you wanted to make like a bridge or something like that, you can do that. But as of right now, you can't. And I believe they're acting crap adding crafting recipes and a lot of other stuff so as of right now that is all the mod has in store but they are adding a lot more and i will definitely love to review those in the future if they do come out so be in be ready for that so that is going to be about it hopefully you enjoyed if you did go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed i would definitely recommend it because there are a lot of awesome stuff like this on my channel and yeah that's gonna be about it i'm on speakable gaming and i'm gonna go um drive this train see you later